Welcome back. Walleye is an extremely popular fish in this part of the country, but if you don't fish, it can be hard to come by. Now a Minnesota-based company could be the first to bring sustainably raised walleye to the market. Noah Fish has more on Blue Water Farms in this week's Ag Week cover story. There's farm-raised salmon, trout, and even shrimp. But Minnesota could be home to the first indoor commercial walleye farm. Blue Water Farms founder and CEO Clarence Bischoff says it would be good for people and the planet. Wanting to find a way to provide uh, healthy fish and provide uh, a good product for healthy people and uh, do it in a way that uh, allows for a healthy planet as well. Blue Water Farms plans to operate a walleye hatchery in processing facilities in southeast Minnesota, using recirculating water technology to produce the walleye. They also plan to use the nutrient-rich wastewater in an operation to grow products that might include lettuce, strawberries, cherry tomatoes, and herbs. I think it's very efficient, uh, and it's uh, uh, really uh, in, in alignment with the sustainability principles that are essential part of our company. Bischoff and Blue Water Vice President Jessica Coburn says it's the right business model at the right time. Exciting, but because aquaculture is fairly new in the U.S., there's a lot of questions still remaining around it. Bischoff has put together a team of scientists, engineers, and advisors to build an efficient and sustainable operation, but they will need a lot of help from investors to make the plan a reality. I think walleye is a great fish to bring to market. We think a lot about salmon and some of our other popular food fish and and give walleye another look. We're going to be bringing them to you in a more sustainable way. So although the process has been difficult, the goal is simple. Raise good, healthy food in a sustainable way. In Welch, Minnesota, this is Noah Fish for Ag Week.